Unlock your door. Passed out. Hey, put it in park. Put your vehicle in park. Unlock your door. Turn it off. Unlock your door. I'm sure for something. Let's take place. What's going on? Do what? I was in Missouri. Okay. And I ate a gummy. Okay. And I'm trying to get home. You passed out behind the wheel. I did. Alright. Okay. What I'm going to have you do, step out to the back of your vehicle. Okay. Go step out okay. now before there's no traffic coming. Okay. There okay. is a gun. Don't reach for anything. I'm just I telling you, know. step out. Okay. Let's reach it now. Come back here. Place your hands right there. Anything on you that's going to stick me, cut me, or poke me? Okay. Place your hands on the back of the car. I'm going to pat you down, okay? Spin around here. Spin around for me. Okay. Give me a contact and ambulance for you. Huh? I'm not going to jail. Well, I don't know if you're having a medical issue or you're just high. I'm not having a medical issue. You're just high? Yes, sir. Okay. Step over here. You can lean up against the car. You ain't going to be able to stand up. Where's your ID at? Is it in here? Yes, sir. Hey, I'll be out with K-28. Amy Stewart. So, what all have you taken today, Miss Stewart? A gummy. One gummy? How big was that gummy? Like one. Okay, just one? I know. It's How not big? Me. I don't just a regular gummy? One. I just, 
So, how long ago did you take it? It's almost 7 o'clock now. In the afternoon. Two o'clock? Have your medical on? Yes, sir. Okay. How much weed's in the vehicle? I can smell the weed. Open the door. There it is. The container that was in. Okay. What, I didn't look. What's the, what's the container it's in? What color is it? It's a Ziploc bag. Possibly color. Five hundred twenty-one. I'll call you right there. Yes, sir. Make a quick traffic stop. Can you let them know to get that caller? I whoever called that in. I need their information with a callback phone number. Same type from Retro still. Get the RP on their call. Get all their is this, information. Is all of it in here? Their names and their phone numbers. Is there more? Um, I, was, I have four of these things I can pick there. I'll have to see what they're doing. Okay, all right, step down. Oh, there's your gummy. Uh, is this one of them? Is this the one you took? These, this infused one of these? That's me, that's me. Huh? Looks like it. Okay. Uh. with a black Volkswagen Jetta 270 West uh, just uh, west of true value here in Mount Ida it's got a temp tag on it uh, I think it's out of Texas I can't can't read it all I'm gonna be 10 6 field sobriety yeah. Hot Spring, he can go ahead and start to, uh, next 10 11 for this vehicle So you got no medical marijuana card, all kinds of weed in here. Uh, she's she's jacked up like to a different level of impaired. I can already tell that. We'll give her the opportunity to do some field sobriety here to see if she wants to mess with it. So. Mr. Can you walk to me? Without falling over? Okay. Uh, let me have your glasses. Keep walking towards me. Stay right there for me. Alright, so anytime that anytime you're behind the wheel of a vehicle and you take or ingest, drink, whatever it is, something, are you gonna fall over on me? Anytime you take something that's going to impair your ability to operate a vehicle, uh, it, it causes some issues, not only for you, but for other people on the road and me. All right, so you need to do something that's called standardized field sobriety testing. It involves three tests. First test is me looking at your eyes. Second test is you walking a straight line. Third test is standing on one leg. Do you want to do those field sobriety tests to make sure you're not too impaired to operate your vehicle? Okay. All right. Yes, I mean, what is my option? Well, you, I, I can't make you do the test. I mean, I'm a, 
Yes, sir. Okay. All right, what I'm going to have you do, I'm going to kind of swap places with you here, okay? Okay. I'm going to have you turn and face me, okay? What I want you to do, I want you to put both feet all the way together for me. So they're touching all the way together. Touch your feet. Can you make your feet touch? There you go. Put your hands straight down to your side. Hands straight down the side to the seam of your pants, okay? Straight down the side. Right down. All right, straight. Can you put them in a little tighter for me? All right. Now what I want you to do, I want you to look right here at the tip of this raised finger. I want you to follow the tip of this raised finger with your eyes and your eyes only, keeping your head perfectly still. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. Okay. Put your feet all the way back together for me. Get straight down to your side. Keep following this finger. Just keep following that finger, all right? Okay. Down just a little bit for me, okay? So you think you'd have any trouble walking a straight line? I don't know. Don't know? Okay. So what we're going to do, I don't, I'm not going to put you out there on the, that fog line because that's going to be dangerous. Okay. So what we'll do, we're going to pretend there's a straight line that goes right from the front of my car right on down toward the back of your car here, okay? Just, just imagine that on the ground. What I want you to do, I want you to place your left foot on that imaginary line. I want you to place your right foot and heel the toe directly in front of your left, just like this. And straight down to your side. And I want you to remain in that position while I tell you to move. Okay, so go ahead and do that now. I'm gonna go out on a limb and I'm gonna ask you a question. Do you think you should be driving a vehicle today? Do what? Well, it's kinda of late for that. Yeah, you know yeah. we got a call on you. What if you had a hit? Do what? I realized I got off. Yeah. I'm 
unfortunately it's still not. behind that well. Yeah. So let me ask you, why you wanna, why you wanna choose to, to do that stuff and then get behind the wheel of a vehicle? Well, this is gonna be real hard. Do what? I said this is gonna be it. First time you're gonna hurt this. Life. Done that. You what? I can't even speak. Living my speak. life. Yeah. Done that. Uh huh. And I had no idea like that. Them gummies will mess you up. Well. Yep. Yep. They're uh, they're really really potent. Uh, they they affect you all a whole lot different than smoking weed, but. Uh, so you wanna you wanna try to you wanna try to walk walk straight line? I'm not gonna I'm not gonna put you in position to hurt yourself out here. So. Mm. It's up to you. You wanna, uh, I'm not like I said, I'm not gonna twist your arm, and make you. Okay. All right. So I'll tell you what. Stand in that position. I won't make you try to get in the uh, what we call the instruction position because I don't want you falling over. Okay. So. So they're out there, so whenever I tell you to begin the test, what I want you to do, you're going to take nine heel to toe steps down your imaginary line, okay? All right, so you're going to take nine heel to toe steps. On your ninth step, you're going to leave your lead foot planted, and you're going to turn, taking a series of small steps. And then I want you to return back down that line in the same manner, taking nine more heel to toe steps. It'll look just like this. You're going to start out in this position. One, two, three, so forth to nine. You leave your lead foot planted, you're going to turn, taking that series of small steps, and then you're going to return back down that line in the same manner. One, two, three, so forth to nine. Do you understand that? Okay. All right. So whenever you're ready, you can, you can try to do it. Stay here somewhere. Number of steps on turn. Over the tone, let's go to the tone, step off the line, walk on the foot sideways. <coughs> Done? Okay, all right, you can you can take a rest here and relax. Where are you trying to go to today? Mm -hmm. Taylor, Arkansas, is that right? That's what I see on your driver's license. Yes. Taylor's way down in South Arkansas, isn't it? Mm -hmm. And you said you were coming from where? I was coming from other rest Springs, Missouri. I'm not familiar. How far is that up in Missouri? Mm -hmm. What's it about? Hour, 20 minutes from That's a long ways up there. It is. So at what point in your trip, I know you said like a two o'clock today, what point did you take the gummy? Because I know you haven't made it from from there to here in the condition that you're in. What time? Uh -huh. No, what time is it? Well, it's just after seven o'clock. Yeah. So you're you're telling me you drove that far like this? No. I'm telling you when it get me and that off the road. I mean like it. Yeah. Feel like a feel like in another world right now, doesn't it? Oh my goodness. It's a terrible thing. It is. Alright. I'm not even going to subject you to doing a one-leg stand today. You know why? Because I don't want to pick you up off this ground. So, uh, you're going to be arrested for DWI. DWI drugs. You're going to have to go to jail with me. We've got a record in route for your car, okay? Go ahead and put you in. I'll hang up you in front. Can I get my phone? Yeah. yeah. Oh, we'll get anything out of there you want to go with you. Obviously, if you don't have a medical marijuana card, your, your weed's not going to... It, it, it gets to go with me, unfortunately. Uh, 
I'm gonna go ahead and empty everything out of your pockets, okay? What records coming for this car? Service center, shit, not saying. All right. Nothing in your back pockets, right? Mm -hmm. All right. Lace, nothing in your ankles, right? Nothing's going, nothing's going to get you in trouble when we go up here to jail, right? All right. Nice. See your necklace or nothing, no crazy stuff around your neck, right? All right. Nice. I'm sorry? Really Say it one more time. I can't hear you. You're, still, you're talking really, really quietly. Are you getting in the car? Say it one more time for me. A gun. A gun? Okay. In the car. Okay. All right. All right. It's not stolen or anything, is it? No. Okay. All right. Come back here. We're going to go back to the passenger side back door here. I'm not. I'm gonna hang on to it carefully. All right. It's a little tight back there. However, however's easiest for you. You need to turn around and sit down, butt first, or however. All right. All right. Watch your knee, okay? Don't let me hit it with this door when I shut it. All right. You want your phone and your. I'm assuming your. Purse, what the deal your driver's license was in? You want that to go with you? Yeah. Anything else out of there? I need a tablet, computer. A tablet, computer. Mm -hmm. What? It had the air. There's a little day planner. It's got horses on it. Okay. Okay. I'll get you fine. All right. I'll see what I can, I'll see what I can find. Right. Watch your leg. Okay. Woo! He, he's been located. He called me back. Where was he at? Texas. He broke down on I-30, uh, just east of Sulphur Springs. As long as he's okay, that's yeah, the main he's, thing. He's, so. he's <laughs> Did y'all find this gun by chance? She she told me about it when I first stopped her, and that's why I got her other vehicle. So. She said she pointed right in here whenever she told me. Pointed uh, this way. I assume she meant it was somewhere right in the seat. She wants this to go with her. She said something about a little day planner, a little tablet computer. Do y'all see a little tablet computer or anything? Right. Right. Oh, she wants all this to go with her. What's it? I said she's coming from Missouri. Texas tags or the Bronx, South going, Arkansas. Going to Taylor, Arkansas. Texas tags. Man, it's that one is the most impaired I've seen in quite some time. I ain't gonna lie. Oh really? Dude. Yeah, she was she was with... passed out behind the wheel. No she didn't. And I'm knocking on the door telling her she she let off the gas and shot forward. She probably dropped and I'm like, put it in bar. Like I thought she was about to take off. She probably got high and left her dog. She probably did. She probably stopped to walk it somewhere and forgot, forgot about it. 
she's coming from Missouri. She come down 71, so that's if they, she left her puppy. It probably at the rest. There may be a trail of. There may be a trail of hit and runs where she came from. K28 Hot Springs. Need to check a serial number on a Ruger handgun. I'm going to go in. I didn't see it. Four, five, nine, five, one, six, three, one. Check. Ruger. Uh, it's a Ruger uh, EC9. So she took a CBD gummy? Yeah, worse than 52. Yeah. It's uh, the gummies and the weed are laying there. The, the car raked up. Raked up. Weed. I'm going to send this. Uh, send this with a uh, service center. Saying that was not out of service. Ah, yeah, I'll do it. Probably was a police department. Probably was a police department. It's not stolen, so. Oops, uh. Oh, let's see. Did y'all look in the trunk? No chance? No, I had all that. Oh, yeah, I'll pop it in a minute when I move that stuff. It does. It was pie up here, so I got a comp pie up here. So I've got a, I got to do an inventory form on it, Bobby. Hey, I'm there's a gun I'm sending with the car. Uh, it's not, it, it's not stolen or anything. So uh, she's gonna go to jail. So when she gets out, she can come get it. But I'm not, I'm not seizing a gun. So I've just got to log it on the inventory though. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's fine. It's, it's, trying to load it. it it's drivable. Okay. Yeah, yeah. She was driving. Yeah, that's fine. You okay? Um. So I think I got everything there. I got your day planner, your phone, your tablet, your wall or purse thing. Um. You got your glasses. Uh, the, the the thing the gun's in, obviously we can't take the gun to jail with you. I'm not seizing okay. your gun. It'll stay with the vehicle. It'll be logged on your vehicle inventory form. Uh, so it'll be in your vehicle whenever. County work still rolling. When you get out of. We're about 30 miles an hour. just outside city. I'm sorry, I can't hear you through this partition. You're going to have to talk really loud. Do what? Okay. Is there anything else of value in your car that you want me to list on this inventory form? 
good? Yeah, I'm good. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I'm just I just gotta do the inventory on this car real quick. Okay. Uh, uh, I guess we're gonna go eat real quick. Okay. And All right. Appreciate appreciate back you. Back to the oil. I guess we'll get down. We're gonna go do Lake Run and then. Okay. All right. I'll take her up and be at the jail for a little while. Okay. All right, man. Uh, did you say there's something else you want listed on there? Mike, I'm going to go ahead and unlock the bullpen for her, okay. and she'll sign for it. She's, oh. she's okay. got a power power. Okay, so. all right. All right. You good, buddy? All right. No, you know, nothing you can think of? Sign and okay. I'll have the bullpen ready for you. Do what? Okay. I'm, I'm sorry. Do what? Well, you don't need, there's nothing you need to contact your insurance for. Luckily, you aren't involved in a wreck yet. <laughs> hey, you're going to go to jail for DWI drugs. Well, and once you're sober enough, they'll release you from jail. And, and you can come get your vehicle, which what they're going to do, since your vehicle's drivable, luckily the wrecker service is right across the street. Hey, so this lady here with the wrecker service is just going to drive your vehicle across, so they ain't even going to load it on a wrecker. So, so they're going to take your vehicle right across the road here to Mount Ida Service Center is the wrecker service. So this is, if you kind of... I don't know how much you'll remember, but if you'll look just back behind us right here to the left, that's where your vehicle's going to be. Go ahead. And when you get out, the jail will help yeah, you. The Montgomery County Sheriff's Office will help you. Uh, they'll help you with getting in touch with them and getting your vehicle. Your, your marijuana. Do what? Marijuana. Well, you, you don't have a medical marijuana card and you can't be in possession of well, yeah. marijuana. I mean, this, is, this is first time anything like this ever happened. Well, I'm glad. I'm glad we got you before, <laughs> before you killed somebody. Uh, I, I told them, I said, I'm going to be real honest, I haven't seen anybody as impaired as you in a long time. I've been, I've been doing this a long time, and, and you're, you're, you're very, very, very impaired. Uh, <laughs> uh, I'm thankful, that, I'm thankful that, that nothing bad happened. At least I haven't heard about any hit and runs, and your car don't look damaged, so I'm hoping you didn't get involved in any, anything too major. Uh, on your way to here. I'm gonna I'm gonna go list out the stuff that's on uh, in your car and so we get it on the tow inventory give me just a minute and then we'll be we'll get you on up to the jail okay give me just a few minutes I gotta inventory that car get the serial number of this gun
Temporary tag 28 on this Volkswagen. It's 2973 Lincoln 81. 2973L81. That's the key for it. Let me make sure all this is going amazing. Oh, that's just a short time to X. And I'll get you a cut of this. Thank you very much, ma'am. Thank you. Still okay? Yep. Right. K twenty eight house press. Copy an Arkansas deal. Nine one zero six two nine one four four. Uh, if you could send that uh, as well as the vehicle information in my times over to Montgomery County. Uh, 10 15 Also, you can acknowledge when you're ready.
28, Hot Springs 97 at the jail, any miles when you're ready. Eight eight three one eight.